Ready on the left. Ready on the right. Hi, my name's Dean Morrison. We're going to talk about tube riding. What's up, a good gentleman? Spawns of the seven. Black boots stomping while the people keep stepping. News at 11. Hip hop secret weapons. Close encounter DNA. I'm addressing. Best conditions for getting bowed is usually shallow and kind of doubling up conditions where it kind of draws off the bank or off the reef. Ready on the left. Ready on the right. Usually with a good wave you can just be in the barrel the whole way from the start. Try not to go too fast and just making sure that I'm deep enough on the wave. Deep enough on the wave. Deep enough on the wave. And every wave is different so it depends where you're taking off on the wave too. Try to get in behind it so you can kind of just see it just about to break, but you're in a nice spot where it's not, you know, it's not sucking out too much underneath you. Down by law. Yes, sir. Down by law. Well, when you're bottom turning underneath the leap, you don't want to bottom turn too hard and you want to stay really low on the wave. Usually you want to be sitting right in the, right in the bottom of it and, you know, you can kind of creep up the face a little bit to get some speed and then come back down. Sometimes you have to really straighten out and point your board to the beach and wait for the wave to kind of catch up to you and then bring it around and then go back underneath there. And so you're right in the hook of the wave, which is a perfect spot, which is like right near the phone board. You know we down by law. All right, we mean raw, get em. If you want to get deep, you just stick your arm in the wave and just kind of hold on. And then when you feel like you're deep enough, just kind of rip it out and then maybe uh, do a pump or something. self bomb a lift off. Loosen up the vertebrae. Down by law like a rubber man holiday. Anti-candy rap, listen to the DJ. If you kind of want drive, you can creep up your surfboard or you can come over that front foot a little more. There's a lot of speed in a hollow wave, so you can you know, really put your foot down and you get more speed. Down by law. Yes, sir. Down by law. Show you about how this here goes. It depends on the speed of the wave, you can just kind of, when you're on the wave, you can kind of feel it out and see what the wave's doing, you know, usually sometimes you can just, just stand there and just, you know, the wave does it all around you and then other times you're trying to get ahead of it a little bit more, you're trying to stall, so it's just, just trying to feel the speed of the wave when you're on it. The most important thing I think is when you're paddling, just positioning yourself to try to be behind the peak so you're in the best part of the wave. Yeah. Yeah. Try to stay strong in your stance and stuff. Don't try to move too much in the barrel. You know? Usually your lines are pretty long and drawn out. Ready on the left. Ready on the right. Thanks for watching. I hope it helps you get spit out of the barrels. We're Liverpool journeymen, spawns of the seven. Black boots stomping while the people keep stepping. News at 11, hip hop secret weapons. Close encounter DNA, I'm a judge. Vanglory is Vanguard, third spinning planet. Angelic, so deep that I come on satanic. Plumbers on galactic, Spartan of the yard. I was thrown to the walls, now the dogs feed God. Crystal pod, hovercraft, the merge, brother Jizzle. Raised off the thick sap of Mother Earth's nipples. All the flesh. Black Knight, Tony Stark, fresh. Back from the future with a license to wreck. J-Bond coming from the west side of the pond. Leaving fools shaking.